I just thought I'd share with you uh, just what I do when I replace a roller on, a, on my uh, boat trailer. Um, I've got the uh, boat off the trailer at the moment, and uh, I've just had a look at the rollers. Here's a roller here. You can see it's one of the middle rollers that go up there, right at the centre. What I've seen here is that uh, it's carved a big sort of groove out there. It's about, probably about to carve into the core of that. So this is uh, pretty much just throw away. Now I've just purchased another roller. And what I do is, get some of this stuff. Always good to have around the old marine grease. And I just grab a stick. Here in Australia we use one made out of a gum tree. But in England it might be a birch. Or in America it could be a hickory stick. Sticks are handy. Now, let's chuck it on the shaft of the, the pin. That's that section there. That just comes out with the, after you remove the uh, split pin there. I'll just chuck plenty of this marine grease on there. All the way around. All the way around there. And I've put some in the centre of that as well of the actual roller. Next stage is just gently send it in, tap it in. Send it in the way of the bit of a hammer gets it through and then okay I've just pushed it through and I'll just send it home a little bit more and you can see it's actually spinning really well that's the way it's supposed to be next just uh, don't forget to chuck in your cut in your cutter pin your split pin and after that's done uh, it's just good to go over all the rollers and uh, give them a bit of a grease with the old marine grease and uh, that means that your boat will launch a hell of a lot smoother. Okay, hope this helps somebody out there.